Time today. Watch them catch them underwears and see the picnic on their holiday. See them gaily get about. They love to play and shout. They never have any cares. Get them ready right now. Pow! Get your teddies, get ready for party your teddy. Where have all the bears gone now? Get your teddies, get them ready for a party at 10. Your teddies, get them ready right now. Teddies, teddies, where are you? Where did you go anyhow? Get your teddies, get them ready right now. Get your teddies, get them ready right now. Get your teddies, get them ready for a party at ten. Get your teddies, get them ready right now. And if you don't have a teddy, there's no need to be sad. Grab your favorite friend anyhow. Grab your teddies, get them ready for a party at ten. Teddies are ready right now. Yeah, teddies should be ready for a party at ten. We're gonna have lots of fun. Right down, wherever you be, get your teddy and a snack, and sing with me. You ready? Help me sing. Get your teddies, get them ready for a party at ten. Get your teddies, get them ready right now. Get your teddies, get them ready right now. Let's do a countdown. We'll stop. Ready? Ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Are you ready right now? Oh, I could hear you singing all the way here where I am sitting today. Now, this is something a little different for Miss Tina because she used to play that really big guitar that had six strings on it. But now that she's getting a little bit older, she's changed to a smaller instrument called a ukulele. Say it with me, ukulele. And let's count the strings on the ukulele. Ready? One, two, three, four. My guitar used to have six strings, but my ukulele only has four, and that makes it a little bit easier for Miss Tina to play. Now, of course, it wouldn't be a teddy bear picnic without the teddy bear picnic song. And the reason this song has always been so special to me is I remember my great-grandma Emma Mary Moore singing this to me while we were rocking in a rocking chair. And that led me to search for how old this song really was. And I learned that it was written in 1907. That was a very long time ago. So because it brings back such good memories to me, I hope maybe you and I can make some new memories at the Teddy Bear Picnic. You ready? See if you remember this part. If you come to Foxborough Common today, you're in for a big surprise. If you come to Foxborough Common today, you'll find everyone stayed inside. Huh, it's been hard, hasn't it? But every bear that ever there was will gather inside for cert certain, because today's the day teddy bears have their picnic. And I think I should have sung. Every bear that ever there was will gather inside their living room because today.
today's the day teddy bears have their picnic all right get your get your voices ready well every teddy bear who's been good is in for a treat today there's lots of wonderful things to eat and marvelous games to play on your TV, I hope you'll see me and thank the friends of the library. Let's sign that. Thank you, friends. Sign it with me. Thank you, friends. Because that's the way teddy bears have their picnic. Now, if you'd like, you can clap your hands with me. Picnic time for teddy bears. The little teddy bears are having a lovely time today. Watch them catch them underwears and see them picnic on their holiday. See them gaily get about. They love to play and shout. They never have any cares. At six o'clock, oh wait, not six o'clock, that's supper time. But at noon today, their mamas and daddies will set them up for their lunch. Cause they're hungry little teddy bears. Hey, have you ever played your mouth before? You can do it, you know, goes like this, watch. Ready? Try it with me. Oh, you learned that quickly. Let's try it again. That's awesome. Let's la 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 a lovely time today. Watch them catch them underwears and see the picnic on their holiday. See them gaily get about. They love to play and shout. They never have any cares. That's a high one. At 12 o'clock, their mamas and daddies will make some lunch for them because they're tired, little teddy bears. Well, I hope you might ask your grandma or grandpa or your auntie and uncle if they know that song. And if not, you can teach it to them and you can make your own memories. I hope you're ready to play today. This song is by my friend from New Hampshire, Amy Conley. She has lots of good music. Here's how it goes. The teddy bears are coming to play, coming to play, coming to play. The teddy bears are coming to play at their own house today, I hope. Now, boys and girls, usually when we have the teddy bear picnic, we are outside and we have a little bit more room to jump around and dance around. But because we are in the house, how about if we stop just for a second, look around, make sure you have enough space between your friend or your brother and yourself, because if we are going to jump in the house, we, we need to be very careful. Okay, so let's remember that we are in the house. Here we go. And this is the way that they all stand up, all stand up, all stand up. This is the way that they all stand up and find their safe space today. All right, now remember, look around. Make sure you're not going to bump when you jump. And this is the way they like to jump, like to jump, like to jump. This is the way that they like to jump. Jump, 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 jumpity, jumpity, jump at the teddy bear picnic today. Wow, you're not tired at all, are you? I didn't think so. Well, this is the way that they tippy toe, tippy toe, tippy toe. This is the way that they tippy toe at the teddy bear picnic today. Tip toe, tip toe, tip toe. Very nice.
place. Now please be careful. Cause this is a way they like to dance, like to dance, like to dance. This is a way that they like to dance at the teddy bear picnic today. Oh, so you are, I'm so proud of you for being so very careful. The teddy bears are coming to play, coming to play, coming to play. The teddy bears are coming to play on the, oh, wait, wait, right at their home today. I am so proud of how careful you were. To, ah, flying music. Now, this next song, your mamas and daddies, and especially your nanas and papas, might remember. Because it was written in 1958. Actually, it was written before that. It was actually a Mexican folk song from hundreds of years ago. But a friend made it a rock and roll song called La Bamba. And actually, I learned that La Bamba means to move or to shake. And that's what we're going to do with this song called The Teddy Bamba. You ready? Here's how it goes. T Could we, could we start that again? Thank you. It's the teddy bear bumba. Yeah, the teddy bear bumba. All oh, my friends, a teddy bear bumba. Yeah, the teddy bear bumba. All oh, my friends. You ready? Here's what I want you to do for me. Bears are dancing and prancing. Bears are jumping and stomping on the floor, whirling and twirling. Please be careful, careful, just a little more, little more, little more. Teddy, Teddy Bamba, Bamba da 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 Bamba, Teddy Bamba. to spell. You ready? Goes like this. T E D D Y That's the teddy bear bamba. Cha cha cha. Ooh la la. Ha ha ha. La ti da. Ooh la la. It's the teddy bear bamba. You helped me there with spelling the word Teddy. And usually, when you and I do this game, when we are outside on the common, I ask my friends to come up and help me hold big, big, big letters. And on one side, there's a letter, and on the other side, there's a bear. And every time we switch letters, we change to a hug. Let's see who knows these letters. I'll get my magic wand. We'll see if we can say them together. What letter do you see? That's right, a T. What letter do you see? Wow, very good. What two letters do you see? Yes, D, D. And what letters at the end? Y. Let's say them together. T, E, D, D, Y. Let's say them again. T, E, D, D, Y. Right now, I am going to hum a song 
That means I'm going to sing the music, but I'm not going to say the words. I would like you to put on your listening ears and tell me if you recognize the song. You ready? <laughs> Yeah, you guessed it already. B I N G O, B I N G O, and Bingo was his name. Oh, but now I need you to do something silly for me. I need you to erase all of those letters, those B I N G O letters. And instead of singing that, I would like you to sing T E D D Y. T E D D Y T E D D Y and Teddy is his name. Oh, you try it by yourself. Hmm, 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 T E. D D Y and Teddy is his name. Oh. Now, one by one, just like we do when we are outside at the common, we are going to change the letters into something else. So today, when we start covering the letters, we are going to cover the letters with a heart. So every time you see a heart, I'm going to ask you to give yourself a big bear hug. That's not so hard. I've been missing hugging my friends, so I've been giving myself hugs a lot. All right, you ready? Let's take a big singing breath. In my life there's a special bear. Teddy is his name. Oh, T E D D Y T. E D D Y D E D D Y and Teddy is his name. Oh, you sounded great. Now I'm going to take what color? That's right, a red heart, and I'm going to cover up that T. So now instead of saying the letters, we'll do a hug. We'll just give up. E D Y, you ready? In my life there's a special bear. Teddy is his name. Oh, hug. E D D Y. Hug. E D D Y. E D D Y. And Teddy is his name. Oh, uh oh. Now it's time to take away the second letter. What letter? That's right. Let's cover up the E with a, what color? An orange heart. So now there'll be two hugs at the beginning and then three letters, ready? In my life there's a special bear. Teddy is his name, oh. D-D-Y, D-D-Y, hug. D-D-Y and Teddy is his name, oh, you sound great. What's the next color heart you see? Yes, let's slide that yellow heart right up over the first D. Let's count the hugs. One, two, three hugs. We're running out of letters. Here we go. In my life there's a special bear and Teddy is his name. Oh, hug, 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 D-Y, D-Y, hug, hug, D-Y and Teddy is his name. Oh, here go my tippy toe fingers. Take it, what color? That's, boy, you know your letters. And your colors, that is awesome. Oh my goodness, though. One, two, three, four hugs and just one lonely letter. Let's see if we can do this. In my life, there's a special bear, and Teddy is his name. Oh, 
Why? Hug. 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 Why? Hug. 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 Why? Why? Because we love them. And Teddy, what's his name? Oh, let's wave bye-bye, why? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Bye-bye letters, hello, five hugs, and almost a rainbow. In my life, there's a special bear. Teddy, is his name? Oh. Hug, 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 Hearts, we would have a whole rainbow from our teddy bear song. Now, you know that Miss Tina even has tea that has a name that rhymes. Her tea is called Throat Coat. And the reason I am talking about rhyming is because I am going to need your help with this next song by my friend Joanne Hamill, who lives right here in Boston and has some wonderful, wonderful music. Now, most songs have two different parts. They have the verses, which are usually different, and they have the chorus, which is the same and comes around again and again and again. And I'm hoping that if we can learn these rhymes, that you could help me sing the chorus. All right, ready? I'm going to sing the first line of the song, and I want you to listen very carefully for the last word. Ready? Well, I've got teddy bear fever. I'm a teddy bear freak. Remember that word, freak. Freak. I've got a bear in my room for every day of the... <laughs> you are really good at this. Every day of the week. Awesome. So you already know the first part. I've got teddy bear fever. I'm a teddy bear freak. Got a bear in my room for every day of the week. All right, here's the second rhyme. Listen carefully. Bears in my closet. Bears on my shelf. Sometimes I think that I'm a bear, my. I just cannot fool you. <laughs> that I'm a bear myself? You were right. Let's put that all together. Ready? Here we go. Well, I've got teddy bear fever. I'm a teddy bear freak. Got a bear in my room for every day of the week. Bears in my, oh sorry, bears in my closet, bears on my shelf. Sometimes I think that I'm a bear myself. Nice job. Now that is the chorus. It's going to come around again and again. So be ready to help me, won't you? Well, I've got a favorite furry bear. She's big and soft and brown. Well, her ear is torn and she lost one eye, but I carry her all over town. You ready? Help me. Cause I've got teddy bear fever. I'm a teddy bear freak. Got a bear in my room for every day of the... Oh, I knew I could count on you. Day of the week. Bears in my closet. Bears on my shelf. Sometimes I think that I'm a bear myself. You ready? Now, if you see on the chair, I've got teddy bear fever here. I've got a polar bear and a panda. No koala and her cub. And every time I pass them by, I give them a big bear hug. Help me. 
Cause I've got teddy bear fever I'm a teddy bear freak Got a bear in my room for every day of the week Bears in my closet, bears on my shelf Sometimes I think that I'm a bear myself Wow, I hear you! That is awesome rhyming! Well, I feed them and I bathe them And tuck them all in bed I've got lots of other toys, but what I can choose I play with my bears instead Last time, let's hear you Cause I've got teddy bear fever I'm a teddy bear freak Got a bear in my room for every day of the week Bears in my closet, bears on my shelf Sometimes I think that I'm a bear myself Oh no, let's growl Oh, sometimes I think that I'm a bear myself Grrr. Although your teddy bears don't growl that you do, they just, just really, really bears out in the forest Very, very nice, thank you for that rhyming Now, you have been sitting for such a long time I think now I'm going to ask you to please stand up and I am going to ask you, with your teeny tiny inside feet, to take two teeny tiny steps. Try it. One, two. One, two. That is your dance step for this next song called the Teddy Two Step. And it sounds a lot like that song you know called the Hokey Pokey. La 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 Awesome. Now here's the part that I'd like you to sing with me. Well, you do the teddy two step and around one time you go. Oh dear, oh dear, that was too many. Just just one time. Show me one time. Yes, that's beautiful. Because I'm afraid if we go too many times we'll get dizzy, we might hurt someone. Let's try it. Well, you do the teddy two-step And you turn one time about Then stop and kiss your bear right on his snout Snout? What? Let me show you polar bear's snout That is a snout That's just another word for a bear's nose and mouth And all bears have a snout You and I just have a nose and a mouth I'll touch the baby bear's snout and the mama bear's snout. Maybe I'll give the baby bear a kiss. And that's what I'm going to ask you to do. You ready? Watch. You do the teddy two-step and you turn one time about. Then stop and kiss your bear right on his furry snout. Nice job. Remember how the hokey pokey goes? Well, this is kind of like a hokey pokey for bears. All right, get your bear's paws ready. Get your bear's belly ready. Check your bear's tail. Make sure they're all ready to play. Let's start out with putting the bear paws in. Let's put your bear paws in. Good job. Now take those bear paws out. Nice. Now put your bear paws in and shake them. Shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them all about. Here comes your part. You do the teddy two-step, turn one time about, then stop and kiss your bear right on his furry snout. Mwah! Nice job. Ready? Uh-oh, this is the silly part. I like this. Put your bear's big belly in. Now take your bear's big belly out. Oh, my. That is a big belly. Now put your bear's big belly in. And you shake it, you shake it. Come on, come on and shake it, shake it, shake it all about. That was awesome. Now do the teddy two-step. Turn one time about. And stop and kiss your bear right on his furry snout. Mwah. Now turn around. Show me your bear's stubby little tail. You ready? 
you put his stubby tail in. Good turning. You take his stubby tail out. You put his stubby tail in. You ready? And you shake it, you shake it, you shake a shake a shake a shake, you shake the tail about. You do the teddy two step, turn one time about, then stop and kiss your bear's furry snout. Mwah. All right, you ready? Now be careful. Again, remember we're inside. You put your whole bear in, you take your whole bear out. You put your whole bear in, uh, and you shake him, you shake him, or her, or him. You shake and shake and shake and shake and shake that bear about. Oh, your poor bears, they're going to need a nap after this. Oh, you do the teddy two-step, turn one time about, then stop and kiss your bear right on his furry snout. you for playing along with me. Now, I remember when my son was very little that this was one of his favorite books. And I hope it's one of your favorite books too. Because it is a book that you can not only read, but I have discovered that you can sing this story. And the author of the story, that's the person who writes all the words, is Mr. Bill Martin, Jr. And the illustrator, the one who draws all the pictures, is one of my favorites, Mr. Eric Carl. And I love this book. I don't know if I love it more for the simple words or for the beautiful pictures. But I learned that you can sing this story. And I'm not going to tell you what song it sounds like. I'm going to ask you to listen again. You, you might hear two different songs. So as soon as you know it, you shout it right out. You ready? Hmm, 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 hmm. How many of you said twinkle twinkle? That's right. How many of you said ABCDs? You are both right. Let's let's just hum that. Mm, 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 mm. So, instead of reading, brown bear, brown bear, what do you see? We are going to sing it to that melody. Remember, the melody is the music. We are going to sing it to the melody of Twinkle Twinkle, or ABCs. Let's try it. Brown bear, brown bear, what do you see? Sound great. Let's sing all the way through. Ready? Brown bear, brown bear, what do you see? What do you see? I see a red bird looking at me. Red bird, red bird, what do you see? I see a yellow duck looking at me. Quack, yellow duck, yellow duck, what do you see? Nay, I see a blue horse looking at me. Blue horse, blue horse, what do you see? I see a green frog, ribbit, ribbit, looking at me. Green frog, 
Green frog, what do you see? I see a purple cat, meow, looking at me. Purple cat, purple cat, what do you see? I see a white dog looking at me. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, white dog, white dog, what do you see? I see a black sheep looking at me. Ba, ba, black sheep, black sheep, black sheep. What do you see? I see a goldfish looking at me. Oh, goldfish, goldfish, what do you see? I see a teacher looking at me. Teacher. Teacher, teacher, what do you see? I see all the children looking at me. Children, children, what do you see? Oh, big breath here. Oh, I see a brown bear. I see a red bird. I see a yellow duck. I see a blue horse. I see a green frog. I see a purple cat. I see a white dog. I see a black sheep. I see a goldfish and I see a teacher looking at me. And when we get to the last page, we sing the end. You sounded absolutely Wonderful, and I hope maybe now that you know how to sing Black Brown Bear, Brown Bear, you might sing with your brothers and sisters. Now, I am very sad to say that our friend Smokey the Bear couldn't be with us today because he has been so, so busy checking for fires, because boys and girls, it has been very dry this summer. We have not had enough rain, and that's when forest fires can start. If lightning strikes, or if someone forgets, if someone forgets to put out their campfire. So, you will see a bear. He even gave me a hat to show you. This is the kind of hat that Smokey wears. It's called a ranger hat. And he keeps this hat on. This keeps the sun off of his head. And I think he gets his binoculars and he goes up into the fire towers and looks. Because where there's smoke, there is surely fire. And if Smokey can teach us one lesson, just one lesson, is that all of us are responsible. That means that all of us need to do our part to keep the forests from, from getting on fire because without the forest, we couldn't have nice shade. We wouldn't have nests for the birds and homes for the squirrels. And the one thing that Smokey would like us all to remember is written right down here. And it says, only you can prevent forest fires. Now, prevent is a grown-up word that means to stop them from happening. So if you are camping with your family, make sure you remind them to pour water on their fire and make sure it goes out. 
to not leave anything near your fire that might catch on fire. Only you can help Smokey to stop fires in the forest, right in their tracks. It's not so hard to do. Now, I had to go all the way to Canada. I didn't really go all the way to Canada, but I had to write all the way to Canada to my friend Raffi. Raise your hand if you've ever sung a song by Raffi. Me too. He is one of my favorite, favorite singers of all time. And I hadn't been playing this song, and someone asked me why I didn't play it. And it's called Teddy Bear Hug. I bet you know it. If you're looking for a body with a hug to share, and everyone around's too busy to care, don't you fret and worry, don't you go and hide under the rug. That's silly, you don't want to do that. Just go and find your teddy and give that bear a great big hug. We've already done this. Here we go, ready? Teddy bear hug. When you really need a teddy bear hug, carry something furry, teddy bear hug. Teddy's always ready with the bear hug just for you. Oh, there are big bears and small bears, short bears and tall bears, mama bears, papa bears too. There are brown bears and white bears, day bears and night bears. Fuzzy bears and wuzzy bears, all with the cuddle for you. Help me sing, teddy bear hug. When you really need a teddy bear hug, Te I love it. Carry something furry, teddy bear hug. Teddy's always ready with the bear hug just for you. Let's la la, ready? La 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 la. Tina needs a big bear hug right now. Give yourself a great big bear hug. Thank you. Now, boys and girls, because we couldn't be outside and all together today, we are not going to be able to do our teddy bear parade with Mrs. Rosetti carrying her horsey and leading the way. But I am hoping that right now, if you have a second, to please go and get the instrument that we asked you to get maybe a little earlier this week. But you know what? Don't worry if you don't have any kind of special instruments like Miss Tina. Because if you ask your grown-ups to borrow something right from the house, you can make your own instruments. If you ask, may I please have two pencils? You can play tapper sticks, just like Miss Tina does. Or if you wanted to make even a bigger sound, you could ask a grown-up if you could borrow some some wooden spoons to play, but be sure you ask them before you take anything. Now, because Miss Tina works with children, she has a lot of different shakers that she buys at a store. But I made a discovery last year, a science discovery. I planted these little vegetables in my garden called gourds. Say that with me, gourds. And at the end of the summer when they were ready to be picked, I picked 
them all off of my garden vines, and I took a teeny tiny little nail, almost a tack, and I, I made some holes, just three, around this gourd, and I set it up in a basket to dry. And I kind of forgot about it. But then this winter, I saw it in the basket and I picked it up. I made my own shaker in the garden. In fact, I made two shakers today. So in the fall, pick yourself some gourds and make your shaker a shaker. Shake it your way. Now, I know that you would probably paint yours because you're really good artists. But I just left these plain so that you could see. These are right from nature's garden. And the only thing you need is time. Is time to let the seeds all dry out inside. And you can have a homemade shaker that you can play forever and ever. So today, I thought, instead of having a teddy bear parade. Why don't we have, why don't we do a teddy bear band? Would that be fun? So while I'm getting set up, why don't you hurry, get your instrument, come on right back. See what you can find, and be sure to ask your grown-ups, because we don't want to be playing things as toys that might be something really important. All right, are you back? glad to have you because we are going to play in a teddy bear band teddy bear band teddy bear band won't you come and join me in a teddy bear band play in a teddy bear band you can tap shake or ring a bell in my band in my band in my band you can Clap your hands to the teddy bear band any way that you would like to play. You're welcome to join us today. Here we go. Come on, everybody, can you play along? Play along on this song. Come on, everybody, can you play along? Playing in a teddy bear band. Hey, do you think? that you could la-la and play. Let's try it. Miss Tina's trying here. La-la-la-la-la-la-la-la-la. La-la-la. La-la-la. How you sound awesome. La-la-la-la-la-la-la-la-la. Let's hear those opera voices. La-la-la. As we're playing in a teddy bear March, we could jump, but remember, look to your right, to your left. Make sure you're safe and you won't be bumping anyone. Come on, everybody, let's jump, 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 jump. Oh, come on, everybody, we'll play and jump, play and jump in our band. Awesome. Look, sit down again and. Keep on playing, keep on playing, keep on playing. Let's sit down again. Keep on playing, playing in a teddy bear band. Let's play a little faster. You ready? Oh, come on, fast, fast and fast. Can you play fast? Can you play fast? Come on, everybody, play faster, fast. Can you play fast with me? <sighs> that was too fast. Let's just play regular. Oh, thank you all for playing in a teddy bear. for playing in a teddy bear band. It was so much fun singing with you today. Oh, what? Oh, oh my goodness. All of my bears. Ooh, they are all yawning. Oh, are you yawning too? Hmm. We have been singing and reading a long time. How about... Oh, I really wish I could stay longer. How about if we sing a very quick 
goodbye song. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye, my friends. Thank you for coming to play. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye, my friends. I hope you have a very, very wonderful day. Now, yummy, yummy, time for snacks. Time for snacks, as I say, bye-bye. Yummy, yummy, time for snacks. As we sing goodbye. As we sing goodbye. Boys and girls, I hope that you have a wonderful rest of the summer with your family. Jump in your little swimming pool and splash and play. And whatever you do, be safe. Be safe in your town today. Please remember that I love you and I thank you for singing songs with me and dancing today at the teddy bear picnic. are coming to play, coming to play, coming to play. The teddy bears are coming to play at their own house today. It's the teddy bear bumba. Yeah, the teddy bear bumba. All oh, my friends, the teddy bear bumba. Yeah, the teddy bear bumba. All oh, my friends. You ready? Here's what I want you to do for me. Bears are jumping and stomping on the floor, whirling and twirling. Please be careful, careful, just a little more, little more, little more. Teddy, Teddy Bumba, Bumba da 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 Bumba, Teddy Bumba. Well, I've got teddy bear fever. I'm a teddy bear freak. Got a bear in my room for every day of the week. Bears in my, oh, sorry. Bears in my closet. Bears on my shelf. Sometimes I think that I'm a bear myself. Nice job. Now that is the chorus. It's going to come around again and again. So be ready to help me, won't you? Well, I've got a favorite. Maybe I'll give the baby bear a kiss. And that's what I'm going to ask you to do. You ready? Watch. You do the teddy two-step and you turn one time about. Then stop and kiss your bear right on his furry snout. Nice job.